Welcome to another beautiful day at the River House. I'm on lily duty. So these lilies were growing where the septic tank line is about to be dug. So I'm relocating them and I'm just clustering them right here along the drip edge of this rock bank overlooking the road. It would be my dream someday to, much like my grandmother did, to landscape this hillside with some beautiful flowers and I think we got some some wild cherries and whatnot growing up, so yeah I think it'll be wet enough there if not uh, they had a fighting chance as opposed to becoming backhoe chow the gentleman is going to come out later today and uh, go over the field so that we're all on the same page Lots of trucks today. So we're all on the same page. And hopefully we'll get started on that here pretty soon. I don't know if it was a productive day, but it was a day. While we were waiting for the septic tank stuff, Shay and I took care of this. This is where they, uh, I don't know, there was an entire mountain of bark right there, so got rid of it. Got a little toasty, but got rid of it. Plants are planted. Some logs floating by in the river. So we're all set on starting the septic. Again, the, the reason I'm not doing it, uh, number one, I've never done one. This is a, a gravity injection, so it's a little more complicated. And the whole system is sort of right at the edge, right? They didn't really like it. This guy's got a reputation for getting it through. So I'm, I guess I'm paying for the reputation. So what we're talking about doing is putting the tank more or less right in here, sideways. He's going to pick up some of these rocks and set them down there, sort of a little retaining wall so we can fudge closer to the bank if we have to. The line is going to run right down through there, hugging the rock edge and then go down Go down right through here, and uh, that's where the infiltrators will start. And you'll put a junction box there, and we'll have three infiltrators. They won't be equal length. The first one in here will be a little shorter, and then the other two a little longer. But we'll get them in. And then we've got all this dirt to backfill. It'll be, it'll be basically a mound system where we have filled in between the mounds, so they're not actually mounds anymore, if that makes sense. The lawn will be level enough. He also offered up his son and their skid steer. Well, this is sketchy. To maybe clear out underneath the house so that uh, we'd have more room. Maybe actually get something underneath there. So that's definitely a possibility. The weather holds, Dad's going to come up tomorrow with the cat, and uh, we'll do pizza and a dirt moving day. And he's talking about maybe having them start on that the new driveway and begin shoving this material down and sort of get that lined out. And then while he's got the cat up here, he can move some of this stuff and, and make it a little easier for the guy's backhoe to get up. I found my tooth found the backhoe tooth I broke off. Not that it does me any good. It was cracked. So it had been it had been cracked for many many years and then I just I just popped it. Just popped it. So 
I mean, I don't know what good it is, but at least now I have it. In theory, my new teeth are supposed to arrive today. I was able to find them a lot cheaper than online. See, online they were some sort of special swallow tail looking thing. I don't know, it just looked to me like you'd break the ends of the tails off. I don't know. Maybe out here you would and somewhere else you wouldn't. But I managed to find what just looks like a socket and a tooth. So, super cheap. I bought three. Uh, if I peel them off one after another, well, I learned my lesson. But otherwise, I have some backups. But yeah, I think that's it. Shay's been playing with the water now for 15 minutes. Hasn't dropped out. Of course, the river's really high, so the water table is super high right now. But the pump hasn't dropped out. That's a bonus. Can't believe all this junk runs. I don't even hear it uh, bubbling and gurgling. Is it still orange? I think it's still orange. Let's see. It uh, does not taste super good. It's a lot like the water out at Alder, uh, the uh, mining tour truck camp. But whatever, it's wet and cold. And it's a beautiful afternoon. Thanks for watching.